Okay, put in the password and go. Battle Kid, episode 17. And last video. Hopefully this, the, this TV is so loud. But I think this is the correct volume balance. I have the volume at 33, because that's my favorite two digit number, as you guys know. My 333rd video, silly, what the crap is this? Why did anyone want to watch it? I uh, went up recently. So, and uh, we're at room 30, 13. That's some threes going on. Okay, this room, you have to. Wait, wait, no, I remember, I remember now. You have to, uh, have to just pretty much dash through. I think. Yeah, just dash through. Dash through that crap. Okay, and then we, I think we need to take. We need to, I don't know if we can DPS him or not. Okay, so just dash through. Like. Actually, yeah, we can. I just have to mash the button faster. Okay, and in this room. Okay, we're safe here. Safe here. Okay, easy room. Um. Okay, so we just need to get to right here. Okay, and in the bottom right corner is not safe, right? Okay, so we can do that. Alright, then it's just a matter of dodging that guy. Okay, officially the furthest we've made it. Okay, so there's some color mancers, and they both drop stars. Okay, that's what I wanted to confirm. Okay, we can... We can get some shots in on them. And they're almost dead. And I only got one shot off that time because I suck. Alright, come on. Okay, there we go. They're dead. Any secret rooms over here? We found a secret room a few parts ago. Okay, more of the, yeah, okay, more of the snails. Okay. Oh my gosh. And then, uh... Block food is gonna make the snail... Okay, let's see. Okay, we got a couple of options here. Ow. I just ate, so excuse me if we, uh, have, you know, whatever. Um, we could certainly move to the far right of the, of the screen there, but oh my gosh, I don't have enough room to jump, so screw that. Um, we could do, hang on. We could do something like that. That's sort of a chickeny way to do it, but, uh, I think it's probably safest. Cypher snails have, what, like, six health? Like, for when they appeared, it was a lot, but... Like, I'm surprised we haven't dead. we haven't died yet. Okay, he's dead. But the thing is that we got, we're gonna have to do a speed run here. No, not as really a speed run, but we can get right there. there we go. Okay, we fessed a lot of these screens in the first try. Okay, there's a color mancer. Crap. Okay, it, okay, he just shoots a wave. Okay, we're safe down here, right? I think so. Wow, this is like a confusing pattern on these guys. But, uh... I mean, each one is orbiting the darker green blocks. Yeah, but I think if we can get up there, I think we're safe. Like that. I'm not... I think we should be safe. Uh, if I jump vertically from the rotating box. So we're just gonna try to get shots in on the color mancer. Okay, he's dead. Okay, we gotta find out which one this guy is. Okay, he's a he's a star dropper. I know you can tell based on the color, but it's sometimes it's difficult to tell. Okay, so we gotta find out what we're gonna do on this screen. I wanna DP crap. And then, wow, I forgot about the eye guy. Okay, so we did really, really well that time. We got like five, four, four five, and I messed that up. Uh, four or five screens on the first try. That was pretty sweet. Okay, we know that we just need to speed run this. And then we can, okay, I messed up the star though. I need to make, make a little bit of hesitation there for like a split second. Okay, speed run. Hesitation. And then DPS, okay. Easy screen. We died a lot on it last video. That's because we had to learn what it was supposed to be all about. And this screen's easy. This screen is not too bad. We gotta take a safe spot here. Wait, 
for that guy to go and take a safe spot here. And not bad. And these guys are both Starmancers, but they are easy to kill. You just gotta play, shoot them, and then play defense. Don't get too greedy. Don't get too greedy. Okay. Not bad. These screens aren't that hard. This screen, however, I think is pretty hard. Anything with a sniper snail is hard for me, too. Okay, yeah. I was trying to speed up a little bit there, and it didn't work out for me. Oh, what am I doing? Speed run. And I DPS the wrong way. Sucks for me. Okay. No, 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 no. Speed run, poop. Speed run. You gotta go. You gotta hold right. Easy. Easy screen as long as you hold right. And then DPS him down. Okay. Okay, and I was a little bit too far over. So you need to be more centered on those platforms. Just be a little careful that way. Okay, hesitate. And then go. Wow, I barely killed him, too. He was about... He almost had me. Fortunately, he didn't have enough life. Okay, wait for this guy. And then we can stick right here. And the good thing is you only have to worry about the left one, really. For that uh, second drop down to the bottom of the area. And I failed my jump there because the kid hit a lock of his hair and we barely dodged the stars. We could probably just get up here. Yeah, once there's just one left, I can go up there and just DPS them. Alright, this screen is probably the hardest one we've encountered. Uh, on this set of screens, anyway. So we're just gonna pay attention to the rotating block and ignore the sniper snail. As far as timing of our jumps. Because the sniper snail doesn't have great reaction time. And it seems like the kid can even get like the sniper snail shots on like a lock of his hair and it doesn't hurt him. I noticed that in that one of those really early screens where I like to trick the sniper snail instead of kill him. It's, I think it's like a, there's like an eye guy that you gotta kill and a sniper snail, something like that. Okay, that's a, I don't know if he hits me from there right there or not. And I don't know why, whatever. I don't think he can hit you from right there though, but I guess we'll see. It looks like it's possible, but I'm not sure. So these screens aren't that bad. Okay. Screens are not that bad. That screen with the snail is not hard, just time consuming, like a lot of screens are in this game. And I need to, if I'm gonna do that and be quick about it, I need to be quick on the button mashing. I'm kind of slacking up on my button mashing. I didn't hesitate there. I know what to do, I just need to have patience to do it correctly. Hesitate there. And then DPS him. Okay. The key word there is DPS, Coop. You have to fire off like five shots in one second. So you need five DPS, I guess is what that is. Okay. Duck here. Duck here. And go. Dodge the stars, get some shots in. Dodge the stars, get some shots in. And rinse and repeat. Okay, one of them's dead. So I'm just gonna go over here and finish them off. I just don't want them to uh, both be there and then absorb shots and then, you know, like one, one of them uses their buddy as a meat shield. Like that. Don't want that to happen. Oh, oh, wow, I jumped at the wrong time there. Jumped at the wrong time, but uh, I didn't die as a result of it, so that's good. Okay, so the snail's dead. And this, okay, I want to see if he can hit you from here. Yes, he can, okay. I wasn't sure if he could or not. Okay, so that's good to know. Because I kind of lucked up on that screen the first time we passed it. So I wanted to confirm that for sure. Yes, him down screen, as long as you remember to stay in the center of the platforms to dodge those guys. Likewise with this, easy screen. And time consuming screen number one, you can get two shots, two volleys on them, except for when I only get one. 
Oh wow. I got sandwiched in over on the left side. Yeah, I'm wondering if I should try to go a little bit more aggro on that screen to save time. That might be a good idea. Although if you go aggro and lose it, then or and die, then you don't really gain any time out of it, so that's sort of foolish. Well, don't drop down there and jump up here. Okay. I gotta get better at shooting while jumping. Granted, the color mancers aren't the biggest targets in the game, so. Okay, there's only one left. Okay, so we can. Oh, he only had like one hit point left anyway. Okay, yeah, annoying screen. Not a, not a hard screen, but just annoying. There's one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, dead. Okay. Yeah, I just need to get into a better rhythm right there, and we can kill that screen. That's not a. I actually, that shouldn't take that long. Okay, so we're, once we're down here, we're pretty much safe. I don't think the color mancer can hit you on that little. I'm gonna fire this way. I want to see your shot. No, fire this way. Come on. Fine, idiot. Okay. I dare you to fire this way now. Yeah, okay, you're dead. Too bad for you. Okay. So this is the screen we made it to. Right? Okay, uh, I guy, and there's a meteor dropping dude. So... I'm wondering which one we should try to kill first. So I guy only has like four health though, right? Oh, crap. Should have ran left. Okay, so I, I think we're gonna try to kill the eye guy first. I think it's the better way to go about that. Or at least that's what I'm gonna say for right now. Okay, and I didn't jump. That's fine. That's fine. And yeah, we should be able to speed run. Get that through your head, Cooper. Get that through your head. Speed run. There we go. Go. Hold right. Don't stop. Take it right there. And then shoot him down. I was like, you have to fire pretty quick there. Like, it's nothing like you need world record style uh, rapid fire for, but you do have to exert some effort to shoot him down in time. It's not one of these, you know, gingerly push the B button a couple times. You know, no, 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 you need to actually lay into it pretty well. Alright, shoot these guys down. Yeah, I don't think we've had a, a, really a headbanger stream, as I like to call them, in uh, quite a while. I mean, we're dying a, a lot in some of these farther streams, but they're not really that hard, I don't think. One, two, three, four, five, six, dead. Right. Yeah, not a hard stream. I think that's probably the safest way to handle that stream. And I still don't know what a safe way to handle this stream is, because you have to move to dodge the the wavy shot but then like you don't have see, you can't you don't have a lot of time as a result of that to gauge the movement of the like these guys are easy provided that you have time okay to gauge their movements and then jump accordingly and what that screen does is it robs you of that time with the, the danger of the wavy shot you're, you're, you're not at a safe spot until you're past the thing that you need to uh, have time to figure out. Or to, you know, not figure out, but see, okay, now I can go. You know, like that. Okay, here's these guys that drop stars. Okay, one of them's dead. So I'm just running around like a chicken. PSM. That's okay. I think that makes it a little bit quicker. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, dead. Alright, easy. Alright, this, however. Okay. I, like, if, you, if I can make it down there, it's not that bad. It's actually pretty easy. Make sure the fire. Fire twice. 
twice, and fire and fire twice. He's not even targeting me. He's not even looking in this direction. Okay, and this has the meteor dude. He knows Draco Meteor. The good thing is that the, the star comes at set intervals. Oh, why did I jump then? No, 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 no. I knew when I pushed the jump button that I was dead. Uh, stupid. Oh, well. Sometimes that's the one. Actually, okay. Uh, I think I didn't land the B button enough there. I, like I described, where, uh, you know, I have to actually. Crap. Yeah, we're dead. Yeah, like, if I gingerly push the B button. Yeah, it doesn't fire all the time. It fires maybe half the time. And that's the annoying thing, is that it fires half the time, so that means that, you know, I think half the time that it'll work. And, you know, half the time, that's fine, but the other half of the time, it's not fine. And we die as a result of it sometimes. Not all the time. Such as, uh, times like this, when the B button fire fails, it's just cost us more time, but when we're trying to DPS someone down, yeah, then it matters. You're dead. Okay, timing thing here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, dead. Okay, easy screen, just, okay, this screen, however, not so easy. Like, I, I don't know. I just have to feel it out really quickly. I don't have a, uh, a good... Whoa, okay, no, never mind. We're safe from right there, right? Yeah, yeah we're safe from over here. And okay, now he's firing at me. But too bad for him. Just the eye guy. Keep your eye open, fool. Open, open up, open up, come on. No, oh, I want to get past the screen. No, no! Uh, I need to be a little, little bit more cautious, I think. A little bit more cautious of the meteor. Okay, yeah. Yeah, they have a good bit of health, but you can DPS him. Okay, come on. Don't do dumb. And don't do stupid stuff like that, okay? We're 17 minutes in, we haven't made any progress. Like, we're going to make progress this video. No! Like, I already knew as soon as I dropped down. I'm dead. Oh my gosh, this screen is easy, but I'll. The thing is that I get frustrated and I forget what it is I have to do. What I have to do is very easy. But. Sometimes, like, you make stu stupid, simple little mistakes. Like, if I was playing this on hard or very hard, which I, I've been trying that out, like, just for fun playing, uh, to the extent you can play this game, then you'll have fun instead of wanting to cut yourself. Um, like, I don't, I, well, actually I still make some stupid mistakes, but not nearly as many. I play a lot more cautious, a lot more defensive. But, you know, when I know I have infinite continues, uh, I just... I try to go a little bit faster and hastier and reckless. Okay, so one of them's dead. And I hate it when you're like running up against the wall and you think that their track on you is gonna be like the next panel over. That that's probably the way they kill me the majority of the times they kill me, except when they kill me like that. Is that like I'll be running from them and like I'll get right here and I'll expect the panel to come you know, like, about right there, and it, instead it comes, like, right here, and I'm dead. So, that's the way they kill me most of the time. Okay. Uh, I want to make progress this video. Because, like, these screens are not hard. Like, we haven't run into a real screen that I consider to be hard. It's just I keep being careless at it. Now, if the screen after that one with the eye guy is something hard, then okay, you know, I'll accept that. And it's hard, and maybe we'll leave the video here. But I want to make it, at least make it past that eyeball screen. It could be a continue point, although... I don't know, how many screens is this thing? Not too many. 
I mean, it's been quite a few, but it's not like a ton. It doesn't feel like the airbase anyway. <sighs> Freaking airbase. I can actually do the airbase pretty well now though. Like, on a, I've done it on one life before actually. Like that's including the boss kill. The bo well, the airbase boss is kind of a joke, so. Fire. Honestly, we can probably get in three shots on him, but I don't want to risk it. Alright, and let's please be a little bit cautious on this guy. No, I start it. I need to get the timing for the star a little better now. No! Uh, I hate I guys. They are still my least favorite enemy in this game. I hate that they have periods of, of invulnerability where you cannot kill them. Uh, yeah, by far, by far, my least favorite enemy in the game. And I, okay, I don't see any other enemy ever surpassing them, unless they also have periods of invulnerability. The clams are easy stuff. The clams have like. What, 2 HP? Easy. And they don't even, like, really threaten because their, their shots are kind of... Their shots are kind of weird and arky and... Yeah. I don't know. I, I suppose if you threw a bunch of them at once, they would become a problem. But as far as, like, an individual clan, it's, like, not a problem. We are getting past that screen this video. I don't care if we have to go up to 25 minutes or whatever. Ideally, we're going to get past the screen on this life. But that remains to be seen. I could still easily die on the screen after this. Which I think is honestly probably the hardest screen. Well, no. You know what? This is probably... Well, I don't know. Which one of these screens do you think do you guys think is the hardest? I mean, this is probably the most annoying one. I think, well, the good thing is you can duck back over here if you don't feel comfortable. So that may, that reduces the difficulty a little bit. Uh, the thing is there, you just have to wait and look for them to go wide like that. And then you can go. And fire your shot. So yeah. they, have, they have six or seven. Seven or eight life, I'm not sure. Okay. Fire your crap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We know that you like drop stars, the okay, eye guys. Okay, we need to be a little bit more methodical, I think. Defense, okay, dodge the star. Dodge the star because I messed up the timing. Okay, the eye guy's dead. We're gonna get some shots in on him. Okay, so he's dead. And we actually could have just went ahead and ran past him, but I wanted to kill him. Okay, and there's... That's a star dude, right? Crap. No, it's okay. How in the world are we gonna get past this screen? Someone tell me. I honestly don't know how we're gonna get past this screen. Um... Wow. Okay. The thing is that the imps have a lot of life. And we gotta worry about getting shot by the mage. Okay. If we could drop down to below, it wouldn't be a problem, but there's spikes. Um. Wow. This may. Yeah, this is the toughest screen, I think. I don't see an easy way to get past this. Wow, okay. Like, we might be able to get, like, one shot at a time on that guy. Wow, this is crazy. And I'm trying to think if we can maybe, like, jump. Hmm. Do I have a laser pointer? No, I don't. I'm trying to think if we can maybe, like, jump on, you know, over on the, uh, the U-shaped block and jump from the top of the U to the other top of the U and see if that's possible to get through here without killing stuff. Do a pacifist. But I think regardless, we're going to have to jump on this middle block 
and so we should probably time our jump to when the imp dude is walking toward us. And god, I wish there was a continue point right here. This is a tough screen. Like, it's, it's, it's bad because this is a tough screen in front of a, or behind a lot of time consuming screens. So that's really annoying. Okay, whatever. We're not, okay, so we're probably gonna leave it here. Um, actually, why don't we just leave it here? Sure, okay. So we're gonna leave it here, and next video we're gonna get tries at this screen. So a couple, several new screens explored in this video. So I'll see you guys for part 26, or no, 26, we're 25 minutes. Part 18. Part 18, where we're gonna get tries at this screen. This is gonna be a headbanger screen, for sure. Later days.